St. Columba and the Crane. Three days from today, he told me, drop everything. Make haste to the islands west and wait upon the shore. There, I say, a crane, flying high but flagging, will fall before you spent upon the shingle. Take her in your arms, cherish her, carry her away, fill her crop with food. On the third day, keep a watch, she will fly. So there I am waiting, gazing like a fool at the horizon, when out of a wind blast falls a starving crane. I stoop and reach to lift her, and her bill drags hollow on the pebbles, her eye is glazed, half sightless with fatigue. She's so wasted that to carry her is less than effort, like lifting parchment. I spend my evenings gathering snails and grains. She takes them listlessly, then sits, then stands, and on the third day lifts her wings and flies. Her voice calls wildly all the way to Ireland. Columba looks for me at Compline, across the choir, amid the plain chant, closes eyes and smiles.